Well, alligators may not be the most attractive animals, but they are survivors, enduring years of human neglect. And now, efforts are underway to make sure that alligators are around for years to come. The American alligator is the last of the true dinosaurs, dating back more than 190 million years. Their ferocious looks and powerful jaws are enough to scare any predator away, even people. They can be dangerous. Uh, you, you have to treat them with respect as you would any large animal. Ron Reynolds should know. He's the reptile curator at Bush Gardens Tampa Bay. For more than two decades, Ron has cautiously tiptoed around these ancient reptiles. They're not man-eaters and they're not particularly a threat to anybody. If we leave alligators alone, they're more than content to leave us alone. That's good advice that could help save this species. Right now, human intrusion is the biggest threat to the alligator. From land destruction to water pollution, hundreds of acres of wetlands are being destroyed. And with that, prime breeding ground for gators. Many of these alligators were rescued from troubled waterways and given a new home at Bush Gardens. The gators get constant care and attention from Ron and the other curators. They're working hard to protect these reptiles, a living link to our past. Protecting this cold-blooded animal involves more than just hard work. It takes education and awareness. Despite these efforts, this great reptile continues to crawl on shaky ground. Why? Because people are not aware. Be aware that alligators are there. Be aware of, of uh, what they are and, and respect that. If our population expands uh, to the degree that we think it might, it, it could mean real trouble. You know, these guys are going to be crowded out of any place to live. People have a choice about where they live and where they can go and how they can get there, and alligators don't. There's good news for the American alligator. Its numbers in the wild are increasing, but its future depends on new breeding programs and protecting its natural environment. For Animal Wise, I'm Julie Scardina.